With the events that happened in the 2000 presidential election, what do you believe should be done to make voting meters more efficient? Okay, in the 2000 presidential election, many of the votes had to be recounted, all the ballots in Florida. This is because of voting technology and votes that weren't counted and incorrect votes. I believe that by using electronic voting machines, we're really not helping at all. In paper ballots, you can easily have a recount or an audit, but with voting machines, there's no proof that one candidate got more votes than another candidate. And if these votes are transferred to another candidate, you really have no clue if maybe he wasn't supposed to win. Maybe it was a miscount of votes. And I also believe because of hacking, you can hack with through Bluetooth or even while these machines are put away through storage. So it's just a bad idea. You also mentioned that in West Virginia, they hacked the military voting like electronically. Um, and if we sent, if we do paper ballots for them, what if their ballots are lost in the mail? What if they're not received in time? What if the men who are fighting for our country's vote, right to vote, are not getting their votes counted? Okay, while electronic voting machines are a bad idea, I do believe there could be some form of technology where maybe for people in the military, only specifically for them, there could be some form of technology where their votes can be counted through by the internet. Um, but so are, are, you these saying that are you saying technology No, they're a horrible idea. Technology is bad. Okay. Um, okay, there were mock online elections for overseas military, and these voting machines were hacked almost immediately as the internet website was up and running. So if you do send it online, who knows whose votes are really being received? With as many people in the military as there are, all these votes could actually potentially cast towards another candidate rather than who they might actually be voting for online. But you did say that no, you should take No, no, I object, okay, I did not mean my first statement. You did say that electronic voting I falsely, would be I better for them. This is a Okay, who would there be to blame if an election was determined on just two or three states' votes and some of those votes were miscounted by humans? That wouldn't happen, I mean, if you have a paper ballot, maybe if a human would miscount, then you could go back through. You can go back there and count again. In an electronic voting machine, you can't really count. You might be able to see how many votes there were total, but you can't see who these votes were for, which candidate the vote was meant for. And if you were able to, you still have no physical proof because it could have been hacked or it could have been manipulated in some sort or the machine could have malfunctioned itself. Can you guarantee me that those hand votes are going to be counted accurately, even if they are recounted? 